Hey guys, me, Mr. Casual, and in this video, we're going to be talking about how Alex Pajeda's sister won her first MMA match. Alex Pajeda's sister is named Aline Pajeda, all right? So we're going to be reading an article on MMAmania.com, but before we get into it, 95% of you guys are not subscribed. If you guys could please subscribe to help support the channel, I would really appreciate it because when you subscribe, it helps let me know that I'm doing a good, that you guys like the videos, all right? So let's get right into it. MMAmania.com. Alex Pajeda's sister, Aline Pajeda, wins first MMA match at LFA 160. You know what's funny? I didn't even know Alex Pajeda had a sister, like, at all. But look, she, you could see, like, they look alike. Like, like the facial structure and stuff, they look very similar, for sure. So Aline Pajeda, younger sister of Alex Pajeda, has won her first mix, mixed martial arts fight. Okay. Pajeda picked up a unanimous decision win at LFA 160 on Friday, June on um, 16th, 2023, by picking apart and battering Chelsea Connor from inside the Owensboro Sports Center in Owensboro, Kentucky. Let's continue. Okay, we can watch like a little clip. Let's watch. So that's Alex Pajeda's sister right here. And this is the girl she beat. This girl's face looks fucked up. Watch. She, I think she takes her down. Look at her face, bro. All right. But anyways, Alex Pajeda's sister ended up winning, though. So, Aline Pajeda picks up her first professional anime win via unanimous decision. See? Look at that girl's face, bro. It's all lumped up and shit. You know? It's crazy. Um, I just clip. She won 30-27, so she won all three rounds. He's mad tall, bro. Like look at her look look at her height compared to her height. She's well this this girl's literally up to her shoulder. Yeah, that's she's fucking tall, bro. Damn. And let's continue. Reading. It was only uh, it was one way traffic for fifteen minutes as Pajeda battered Connor, basically using her for target practice and working on her takedown defense. The Brazilian was close to finishing Connor in the second round, but ran out of time. She eventually got 30-27 across the board. Let's continue. Pajeda lost, um, Pajeda lost her professional MMA debut last year at LFA 147 when she was out grappled and dropped by BKFC fighter and Ultimate Fighter 30 contestant Helen um, Peralta. So she lost um, her MMA debut, but then so then um, on June 16th, she won her first MMA fight, you know? So that's pretty good. She's, she, she's won one. Um, Pajeda 32 is following her older brother's footsteps as a, as a former glory kickboxer turned MMA fighter. They both lost their MMA debuts. Um... They both lost their MMA debuts too. Alex returns to action at UFC 291 in July, making his light heavyweight debut against Jan Blahovich. That's gonna be a sick fucking fight. Jan Blahovich versus Pajeda. The thing is, right? If Jan Blahovich fights Pajeda the same way he fought Izzy, I think it would be the same shit. He'll take wrestle him. And so what is Pajeda gonna do? You know what? Pajeda's a brown belt, but I think Blahovich is gonna end up wrestling him after he realizes he can't strike with him. Unless Pajeda can Alex Pajeda can somehow get Blahovich out of there really quickly. Before Jan Blahovic can like do anything, can, can even start wrestling. If Fajita can knock him out or something before Jan Blahovic can start wrestling, you know, maybe then he could beat him. But if Jan Blahovic wrestles, I just don't see Fajita like winning at all. Let's continue. Um, they view against Jan Blahovic for the first time since losing his middleweight title at UFC 287. And that's, yeah, that's it. I don't know. I just thought I'll report this because I was like, I mean, I didn't know he had a sister. You know, now she's doing MMA too. That's fucking sick. You know, she she apparently used to fight Glory as well. That's pretty cool. I still I'll report this, guys. You know, because you know Johnny Walker's brother is in the UFC. Um, you know, and then and then and then Pajeda's sister is doing MMA. It's pretty interesting to see like siblings of famous fighters fighting. I don't know. Anyways, guys, me, Mr. Kaz, remember, um, 95% of you guys are not subscribed. If you guys please subscribe to help support the channel, I'll really appreciate it because when you subscribe, you know, it lets me know you guys like the video and the content. Anyways, guys, be safe, everybody. All right, take care.